as you know very well, Israel has forged ties with many Muslim countries, including those in the Gulf. And those are no longer secret relationships. Uh, they're not formal relationships. There are no diplomatic ties, but on, on many other levels, there are very good relations. Now, arguably, Indonesia also has much to gain uh, or something to gain from friendlier relations with Israel. So why is it that Indonesia, which is a democracy, the world's largest Muslim majority country, a non-Arab country, and a friend to many of Israel's friends like the United States and Australia, why has it not formed closer ties to Israel? Yeah, you know that Indonesia have no diplomatic relation with Israel, but people to people contacts and uh, business, I think they uh, run it. Uh, many things, sometimes from America or even from Italy or Swiss, but uh, we know the people to people contact is uh, around 100,000 people uh, going to Jerusalem so every year in Indonesia to a mosque, uh, there was a mosque or even a Christian go there, same as well. And they have um, a good surf there. Uh, yeah, of course, no, not, not this year, but uh, before is uh, so much people there. And uh, we have talked directly that uh, Indonesia support Palestine so many years. And we hope there are peaceful solution. We are Indonesia ready. It, it is support the peaceful solution. Support two country settlements, uh, 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 Israel and uh, Palestine. This, if there are peaceful relation, of course, Indonesia will be easily to make a formally um, uh, amelioration relationship with Israel, not only people people. But uh, what we hope that there are peaceful uh, settlement with the uh, uh, Palestinian Israel. Yeah. 